This is as far as we can go. You can see staircase. Yeah. It's fucked. I'm, I'm taking a risk standing where I'm standing. Well, I don't feel. I'm I feel feeling I, the energy. There's an energy. Energy, guys. There's energy here. Fuck me. me. This is bad. Try to fucking push me or something. My legs were trembling when I was on here. Yeah. I got the what was that? What was that, man? Something in that fucking went past in that window. Yeah. There. Whoa. Did you film it? Right, if we shit it, no one start fucking running. No. Dangerous here. No, it clip glips in my eye over here. We're ghost hunters, we don't run. <laughs> we, we won't run from you. Never. You'll have to do the devil himself. <laughs> Give us uh, the EMF meter, mate. Right. There's something in that room, I'm drawn to that flaming room. That's where the energy's coming from. I mean, that's the master bedroom. My torch is going. Taking a fucking risk in here, mate. Unless we do at the bottom of the stairs to go some. No, because you're not going to get this. No. Where's that big light? Okay, let's pass through that big light, I'm going to film you. Right. Once, you, once you've done there. I just want to show... I just want to sh yeah, I just want to show them the angle we're on. Right, it's K2 from that. OK, mate. Oh, it went off then. Yeah, it did. Right, I'm just going to film this angle. If I can. This is the angle we're on. That's how high we're trying to get up. As you can see, the floor, big drop, big holes. Well, we're There's, sensing is it, something. Is that energy still here, what we just felt? Can you come and light that up? I'll give you back this minute. What's causing this energy? Whoa. Don't like it up here, mate. I'm fucking off it in a bit. Whoa. That energy, can you come speak into here, please? What was that? Can we hear that? Yeah. What was that? It was like a squeal, mate. Leave that bag while I get down the step, mate. Right. Got fucking feel right up there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Just turn it like this. This is a step. I'm gone. Yeah, yeah. Put the light there, mate. Right, stand there so I can hold your shoulder. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, let's see. I don't like it. I'll tell you that now. I'm not. There's it's something not nice, not nice up there. You gotta go back and get the key too, you know, yeah. Oh, shit. <laughs> Hi. 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 Hey, that. It's clear as day, that. This is as, as far as we're going on our journey. You understand? Because we're dangerous. We'll take the paranormal risks, but we won't take life-threatening risks. Nope. We don't end up on uh, someone coming hunting us. <laughs> we like to be the hunters. Can you set that K2 off there? Yeah, can you light that K2 up for us? That energy, what we felt when we were coming downstairs. It's like you don't want us to go up any further. That's what I felt. 
Can you confirm that? Can you speak into the device and tell us that you didn't want us to come any further? Was that the master bedroom? Where you were killed? Can you turn that light off there? Well, if you guys have felt it, it's like a dizziness. Yeah. Yeah? But it's maybe, like, maybe it, it could be it could be paranormal, Chris, but it could be the fact that we know we're on dangerous stairs, but it's getting high up. We can't really let out, but it was strange that we didn't feel it anywhere else but here. No. In this particular part of the building. What was that? What was that? He's moving there. Did someone move? Me. No, 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 no. Forget about your head. Did someone move? Get your head out. Did someone move something like a metal bar there? Keep your head out, Chris. Right, Jay, move something. Just don't get your head in it. Right, there was like a metal bar shape. Was that the knife? What was used to kill you? That was strange. No. That was not like that, Chris. No. Like that. No. It was like a thin metal bar or a thin plank of wood. What knife was it? What knife? Was, was it a machete? Kitchen knife. A samurai. Because that's what I'm imaging on that wall. A thin, thin metal object. But not a kitchen knife. Did you not see it on the website? No. The knife what he killed with? No, but he said he got it out of a drawer. So it has to, that suggests it's a small kitchen knife. But what yeah. I've seen on that wall is like a metal bar. Put your head on that there, guys. Yeah, it was no, similar to that, more. so maybe maybe it was that. It, have, it could have been a reflection off that. So that could be a possible debunk, but now it's fell off the fucking wall. You can't really debunk it. What was that? Yeah, wagon. That was a wagon, that noise, guys. Seven that minutes recording. Left. First impressions of the building. Uh, wasn't spooked out. I was more spooked out outside the building. And the dangers. And the dangers. Why are you heading here? Yeah. Um, what was that? It was the same female voice keeps coming through. And then we come to the staircase, which is suggested to Chris, and something don't feel quite right. Me and Andrew picking up on the same Andrew. Six Something minutes. doesn't want us to go any further anyway, even if it was. Yeah, almost like a push-back feeling, that's as far as you're going. Not just because there's a hole, hole there, shit, yeah. we've got to watch that. Not because there's a hole there, because you could balance on that piece of beam, and they look solid. Them three look solid to me. I've not quite had a look at the landing. No, I have actually. I told Chris the landing's not safe. It's uh, it's broken beams. I don't feel right, mate. The fucking balance is off. What the? What the landing won't say? No, the landing's not. It's all uh, wooden beams. You'd have to no. balance on beams. There's no floorboard. Thank you for this journey, but we're running short now. Five minutes on camera. You're gonna have to do something now. Come on! What was that? It's like a scream. Was that you screaming, Alison?
Was it in the master bedroom you took your last breath? I'm getting very, very, very warm in here. Okay, we're on a new level, it's going to be warmer than the bottom level, but not really because it's an abandoned building, holes in the ceiling. What's causing this heat? We haven't got temperature gauge. What's causing it? Anyone feeling warm? Mm. Yeah. yeah. Thank you for responding, spirits. What's this, the, the secret? What lies here? Why no one will buy this place? Is it evil? The evil presence. We've all felt it tonight. Each and every one of us, but we will not back down. Because we're ghost hunters and we want to get to the bottom of the truth. And the truth lies within this building and what went on in this building. What's this building's dirty little secret? Apart from the killing and the murder, is there anything else? Come on. We've got two minutes left, Chris. Anything you want to say? Now I think we'll wrap it up there and... Yep. Listen back at some point on Monday or tomorrow for the finger. Right, we're going to close the session off. Any spirits here must remain here and not follow any of us to our locations. Yep. Any provoking wasn't meant to cause torment or distress. It was all just for the information we could gather. We would like to thank you today for the uh, inviting us here. Anything else you want to mention, Chris? Yeah, you must remain here, not follow us. All we came here tonight was to get gather information about the paranormal and how you died. That's it, really. And we thank you. And we thank you for doing what you've done. Just a prick then. Mm. Yeah. You call us pricks. It's not very nice. May Jesus Christ and God protect me, Chris and Jason, in the power and the faith of the Lord Saviour Jesus Christ. We ask you to keep these spirits here and no longer in contact when we leave this building. Amen. Yep. Yeah.